In today's video, we are going to be doing a hole-in-one challenge. We started off by running to the store, getting a bunch of golf balls, and instead of playing off of a regular tee box, we're actually going to be hitting golf shots off of a trailer from roughly 100 yards. All right, guys, we're back with another YouTube video. Today, we are out here at the junior course again. We're actually doing a hole-in-one golf challenge off of a trailer. If you guys have seen the trailer video in the past, you know what I'm talking about. It's gonna be insane. We have it set up at about 100 yards. So not a terribly hard shot. The main purpose here is to see who can make a hole-in-one first. Micah, how are you feeling? I'm feeling good. We're cooking up something cool off a trailer. I've never hit a golf ball off a trailer. That is going to be I pretty do. sweet. Yeah, what club do you have? I'm going to be hitting the 60 degree all day. Essentially, we bought a bunch of golf balls, and I think 100 of the golf balls that we bought were tailor-made Project A golf balls. So if you guys don't already know, those golf balls spin. That's what we're going to try and do. I got a 56 degree off the mat. We're going to try and fly it past the hole and rip it back in. I'm going to give it a prediction of about 100 golf shots, and we'll make it. What about you? I'm saying 75 or less. I'm feeling pretty confident. 75 or less. Also, Matt and Steven will be joining us a little later. They're currently at Chipotle, but they're also going to give some attempts, so stay tuned for that. This is the setup we got, guys. We got a mat here. It's hoisted up about eight feet off the ground. Bunch of golf balls there. I'm going to set the camera up over there. Chad provided the trailer once again. Shout out to Chad. Everyone in the comments down below say thank you, Chad. Just so you guys know, this is the golf shot we're going to be looking at. It's a little into the sun, so it might not be easy to see, but we're hoping that those shadows kind of go away. We're also going to have a camera angle behind the green. I think we're going to kind of dive right into the action. I hope we make it. This is the back camera angle we're looking at. We're going to go set up the second camera angle on the other side. Mike is going to start by hitting the first shots. Yeah, he might just make it. You never know. Mike has hit probably about three shots. He's gotten a few on the green. It's spinning back. Today, for this hole-in-one challenge, we want to spin it back into the hole. The greens are super soft. Anyway, leave your predictions in the comments down below if you guys haven't already. Yeah, here's what we're looking at, guys. It's playing more like 125, 130. And essentially, we're trying to land it about up in here and just rip it back into the hole. So that's the goal. Not really sure if it's gonna happen. That's just what we're saying. He's already hit a ball there, a ball there, and a ball there. So I'm gonna set the camera up here and see what happens. All right, this is actually a pretty good looking camera angle. Let's see what he can do. Done. I could just hit a shot a little right. I'm just gonna start handheld recording this. Oh, if that would have spun a little more, that would have been in. All right, guys, after 50 shots, Mike hit the first 50 shots, the first bag. Uh, got within a foot, so now it's up to me. We'll see if I can do better. And as you can probably tell, Garrett spins it a lot more than I do. Change it to a 56 degree, folks. Are you serious? That's a lot of spin. That is so crazy. Guys, I like the way this one's coming in. This is looking really good. Oh, that's perfect! Oh no. Oh, that was two inches! That was the closest by far. That was literally right here. That was so crazy. A little bit to the left. Ah. Ah. This is looking pretty decent. Ah, that was the closest one yet. That one looks, that one looks good there, Steve. Short. Short. That's a little short. It's a little long. Flat. It did stop, stop. Just one like, foot, but it whoop. stuck in the ground. Alright, whoa! Zoomed right in. 
into my face. A little update on the video. Okay, Matt almost hit me with a golf ball. Steven is about to start hitting. We've done Micah, me, Matt, and now Steven. We're getting close to hitting 200 golf balls. We don't know the exact number and it's really tough to keep track, so we'll just say we've hit 175 golf balls. Now Steven's gonna get up and hit a few. This is Matt's last shot. And uh, it's way short. Not looking too good so far. We're gonna get to Steven here and uh, yeah, we're gonna see if we can make it. All right, little update. Steven is secretly dirty at the hole in one challenges. He's almost made one already, guys. Oh, oh my God. Jeez, that was close. Steven is hitting it so good. He's gotten the most consistent shots out of everyone. Steven, you almost hold it like 30 million times. How close times. were they? Like, really close. Dang. You almost hold like 20 of them. Kinda OP. Best golfer here. Mike is going next, guys. We'll see if he can make it. We've been out here for a while. But seriously, Steven threw a lot of darts. Almost landed one in the hole, spun one back. Trust me when I say I'm the best here. All right, Mike up here, guys. We'll see what he can do. This is his second time around shooting the golf balls. And I think he made it. Might as well just call it good. Okay, pretty solid shot though. Come on! Four spin and that's in, bro. Good shot, good shot. Don't even know how many attempts, don't even care. Hopefully we can make it here. I'm gonna zoom that out, guys. I don't know if you could see it, it kinda landed in the shadow. Spun left, right in the hole. Dude, that was clean, baby, woo! Woo! Yes! This battery's literally at like one bar. There you have it, guys. A little trailer, hole in one challenge. I'm not even sure if there was much commentary throughout that video. Hopefully it was around like 10 minutes, seven minutes, I don't know. Shorter little video, but if I had to guess, it probably took us around 250 shots. I don't know, I hit that one and Chad said that looks really good. And I was like, no, that's long and it landed, spun left, went right into the hole. Kind of crazy how it all happened, but yeah. Let me know if you were kind of close in the comments down below on your guesses, but spun right into the hole. That's crazy. I haven't won any of these hole in one challenges until today. It's the first one I've won. It ripped back about 10 feet, which is crazy, but. That was a good shot. No, I missed, you missed it. It didn't even go in. Taylor made zero, zero. I feel like a changed man. All right, how do you feel about making uh, the second hole-in-one ever? I don't know if you count it as a hole-in-one, but it is a hole-in-one. Yeah, it was a nice hole-in-one. Uh -huh. First try, clearly, yeah. with a few practice shots. You could say that. But, you know, we woke up with coffee, met someone at Starbucks, just had a nice little conversation, ate some McDonald's. That really got me the nutrients and the food to succeed. We went to a golf shop and bought some used golf balls yeah. because... The fans are worried about your nutrients and the food that you are ingesting because it seems like you have not gained any poundage since yesterday. Well, I haven't actually, that's the <laughs> truth. Um, I think I've actually been losing weight. <laughs> don't want that in there. All right, how do you feel about, uh, how do you feel about the, how do you feel about the hole in one? We made a hole in one today? Oh yeah, no, 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 no. I think Garrett did a good job making it. Okay. How do you feel about making a hole in one? Okay, all right. That's Perfect. pretty cool. Yeah. Thanks. Uh, thanks for watching. If you like the video, please be sure to stay tuned. Please be sure to stay tuned. Until next time, you guys.